What's going on guys, Mr. Meyer here. Okay, today we're gonna to continue with our coin toss game, right? We toss the coin up, tells us how many times we're gonna do the exercise. If you joined us yesterday, you know what I'm talking about. If not, I'll explain the game in a little bit. But as always, we need to get warmed up first, get our body ready, and I'll explain the game, we'll play it. We'll do the bonus round. If you remember from yesterday, we did a bonus round, and then we will stretch at the end. All right, are you guys ready? You sure? Yeah, like, like you guys are gonna answer, right? I said that yesterday in the video. Are you guys ready? Yes, yes we are. All right, so I'm just gonna assume that you guys are ready. So let's stand up and we will jog in place first and go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. 17, 18, 19, and 20. All right, let's do those penguins, the side bends, or the waddle waddles. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. All right, we'll do a little bit of arm circles. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. All right, let's do some side bends. Side, side bends. It's not called side bends. It's called side lunges. Two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, and twenty. All right, let's do some trunk twists. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, and twenty. All right, let's do some hip abduction, legs out to the side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. All right, let's do some side reaches. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20. All right, last one we'll do is we'll do forward kicks. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nine, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20. All right, let's take a seat. So today, we're gonna work on the upper body. So we will be able to stay in our chair. We'll do one exercise, we're gonna stand up, kinda of like we did last week. But let's go over how the game works. Let's move up a little bit. All right, so I'm gonna pick an exercise. We're gonna do it two times, but we gotta figure out how many times we're gonna do it each time. The way we're gonna decide that is, I'm gonna flip a coin. So one side is heads. I have it markered in green, just so you can see and remember that's heads. And then the other side, is silver and that's tails. So if it lands on heads, which is the green, we'll do the exercise five times. If it lands on tails, we will do it 10 times. So again, green heads is worth five, silver tail is worth 10. All right, we'll do it two times and then we'll move on to the next exercise. But if you played yesterday, you know what's going on. So let's do press-ups first. We'll do that nice, easy press-ups. And again, you can stay sitting in your chair. 
because even though we're sitting in a chair, we're still getting good exercise. We're working our upper body, not worried about our lower body today because we did that yesterday. If you want to do the lower body one after this, you can go bring it up in your Google Classroom and then play it again. <coughs> Excuse me. So the first exercise we'll do is press-ups. But anything we're doing today, make sure you're not slouching, all right? You got to sit up nice and tall as you're doing the exercise, all right? So let's see how many press-ups we're going to do. And flip it, and boom. So we landed on silver, so that's tails. So we're going to do it 10 times, ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Okay, we're gonna do it again. Let's see if it's heads or tails. Heads is five, the green side, and tails the silver side is worth 10. So we're doing press ups again. Got it on the green side this time. So we will only do it five times. One, two, three, four, and five. Next exercise we'll do is shoulder raises out to the side here. We're gonna do it twice, but let's see what we're gonna do the first time. How many times we're we gonna do it? And flip the coin, boop. It landed on heads, the green side, so it's only worth five. One, two, three, four, five. All right, second round, let's see how many times we're going to do it. Landed on tails this side, silver side, so that's worth 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Next thing we'll do is the forward shoulder raise. The same thing, just going up in the front. Let's see how many times we're gonna do it the first round. Boop. Landed on green again, so we got five. One, two, three, four, Five. All right, second round. Let's see how many times we're going to do it. Boop. Landed on silver. That's 10 times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. All right, one of my favorite ones. We'll do that hand press. If you were with us last week when we were doing the card game, when we did upper body. So you're gonna take one hand here, one hand here. You're gonna push them up against each other so it kind of stays in the middle. So this hand's pushing this way, this hand's pushing this way, but they're pushing into each other and you're gonna hold it there and push it as hard as you can. And this one's funny because it makes me actually like shake around a little bit. All right, so let's see how many seconds we're gonna do that one for. All right, boop. All right, landed on tail, so we'll hold it for 10 seconds. And go, one, two, press hard. Three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, ten. Ooh, face turned red a little bit there. All right, second round. Let's see if we get heads or tails. What oh, do I dropped it? Landed on heads, so we'll do it for five seconds. One, two, three, four, five. Ooh. Next one we're gonna do is something called pullbacks. Excuse me. So you're gonna sit up nice and tall. You're gonna grab like you're holding something and you're gonna pull it towards your chest or your stomach. So you're gonna pull it and come back. I'll show you what it looks like from the side. So you're here and you're pulling it into your stomach and back out so your elbows are going straight behind you. All right, let's see how many times we're gonna do that one. All right, whoop. Silver, so we'll do 10 of them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, I think we've been getting heads and tails, like we're doing one or the other. We haven't gotten a bunch in a row yet. All right, um, now that I said that, you know we'll get tails again. All right, second round. Oh, I was right, we got tails again, so we'll do ten of those. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. All right, next thing we do is those bicep curls that we did last week. So your elbows are on your side, pretend that you're holding something heavy and you're going to lift it up towards your chest and back down. And the bicep muscles are right here. You know, like if someone says, hey, let me see your muscles, man. And you go like this, those are the muscles that you're trying to show them that they are, okay? So when you're doing bicep curls, you're working those muscles. 
Let's see how many we're going to do for the first round. Boop. We'll do five. And you guys know, if we do five and you want to do ten, go ahead and do ten. One, two, three, four, five. All right, second round. Let's see how many we're going to do. Five again. That was heads. One, two, three, four, five. All right, next one we're gonna do is we're gonna do something called the tricep extension. So I'll show you what it looks like from the side. So you're gonna put your hands behind. Oh, wait, back up a little bit. So you're gonna put your hands behind in a fist and you're gonna come straight up in the air and back down. Straight up and back down. So the tricep muscles are back in here, right? When we do back scratches, that's the muscle we stretch. So now we're not stretching it, we're working it out. If you want to hold a water bottle while you're doing that, give yourself a little resistance, add a little weight to it, and works your muscles a little bit harder. But you don't have to if you don't want to. All right, let's see how many tricep extensions we are going to do. Ready? Whoop. Tails, and landed silver. So let's do 10 of those. I'll show you from the side, but you can sit uh, facing the video. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. All right, second round. Let's see how many we get for tricep extensions. Tails again. So let's do ten. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. All right, we're gonna do one that we haven't done before. I call, I'm gonna call it the seat belt. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna pretend that you're grabbing something from up here like a seat belt, and you're gonna pull it across your body, almost like you're clicking it into whatever that's called, the seat belt clicker, a thing, a I don't even know what it's called. So again, you're gonna come from here, like you're pulling a seat belt and click it in. All right, here and click in it. But whatever we do on the right side, we'll also have to do on the left side. So let's see how many we get. Boop. Silver, so that's the tails. We're gonna do 10 of those. So we'll do 10 on this side, and then we'll do 10 on this side. Ready? And go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, it's almost like an axe shop, eight, Nine, ten. Now we gotta do ten on this side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. All right, second round. Let's see how many we're gonna do. Ten again. It was on tails. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now we'll do ten on this side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten. All right, next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna put our arms like this and we're gonna pull the side like we're pulling stuff from behind us in front of our body. In front of our body, all right? Let's see how many we're going to do. Five of those. All right, so arms here. And one, two. Remember, you're pulling something. Three, four, five. All right, second round. Boop. Heads again. Let's do five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so our bonus round, if you were with us yesterday, here's how it's going to work. I'm going to flip the coin. Before I flip the coin, you're going to think, is it going to be heads or tails? You have to pick one. If you are correct, you only do the exercise five times. If you're wrong, you have to do it 10 times. And even if you're right, you want to do the exercise 10 times, of course you can. I'm never going to stop you. I think that's awesome. 
So don't get upset like, oh, I lost again. That's actually kind of good for you because you're getting more exercise, all right? So again, if I flip it and you thought it was gonna be heads and it lands heads, you only do the exercise five times. If you thought it was gonna be heads and I flip it and it lands on tails, you have to do it 10 times because you were wrong on that one, all right? So we'll go back to the top of the order and then we'll work our way down. So the first thing we did was press ups, all right? So in your head right now, start to think, what do you think it's gonna be, heads or tails? Remember, heads is green, tails is silver. All right, heads or tails, what do you think it's gonna be? Okay, let's flip it. It came up tails. So if you said tails, you can do it five times. If you said heads, the green side, you gotta do it 10 times. But if you wanna do 10, you can do 10. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. And I'll always do it 10 times with you guys. All right, next one we're gonna do is those shoulder raises out to the side, fly away like a bird. All right. Start thinking right now. Do you think it's going to be heads or tails? All right. You got it? Good. Zoom. Tails. So if you said tails, five. If you said heads, it's ten. Right? Did I say that right? Tails, five. Heads, ten. Yeah. Here we go. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine and 10. Next thing we'll do is those forward shoulder raises. All right, so start thinking right now. Is it gonna be heads or tails? Make your decision. If you're right, five. If you're wrong, 10. There we go. Flipping it, boop. Tails again. So if you said tails, five. Heads is worth 10. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. All right, next thing we'll do is that hand press, pushing really hard up against. All right, start thinking heads or tails. Here we go, you got it? Yeah, we're ready. Oh, that's nice, good. Boom, it landed on heads. So if you said heads, it's worth five. If you said tails, it's worth 10. All right, but I'll always do the 10 seconds with you. And press really hard. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine, ten. Nice job. All right, next thing we'll do is those pullbacks into here, right? So your elbows are coming straight behind you. It's almost like a row. Oh, all right. In your head, is it going to be heads or tails? You got it? Boop. It landed on heads again. So if you said heads, five. Tails was worth ten because you got it wrong. All right, nice and tall. And pull back. Keep your elbows behind you as you go back. Two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. All right, next one we'll do is those bicep curls. Remember, hey, how strong are you? It's so strong. Are you? Look at my muscles, right? So that's gonna work those muscles right there. So bicep curls. Let's see how many we're gonna do. Oh, did you already pick what you were gonna think? Did you pick what you were gonna think? That doesn't even make sense. Did you think it was gonna be heads or tails? That's what I meant to say. All right, well, it landed on heads. So if you said heads, five. If you said tails, it is worth 10. All right, bicep curls. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. And like I've said before in other weeks that we've done exercise like this, if you wanna add a little resistance, a little bit weight to it to work your muscles a little bit harder, you could hold water bottles while you're doing it. Each, any one of these that we're doing today, you could hold something to get, make it a little bit harder for your muscles to work, which actually makes them a little bit stronger. All right, so next thing we do is those tricep extensions, so hands behind, and then they go straight up. This is a good one. You can hold one water bottle, and you bring it up and back down. All right, start thinking in your head. Is it gonna be heads or tails? All right, make your choice. All right, here we go. Boom, it's tails. So if you were right and you said tails, five. If you said heads, it's worth 10. All right, here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, next one we'll do is that seat belt pull. All right. Start thinking heads or tails. Make your choice, because I'm going to flip the coin. Woo, woo. 
Ooh, it landed on heads, the green side. So if you said heads, five. If you said tails, 10, but I'll always do 10. And if you want to do 10, join us. It's great. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. But we only did this side, so now we have to do this side. And go. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. All right, last one. We'll do those press to the fronts. All right, so your elbows are bent, hands are here, and your forearms are coming together. Same thing. You want to hold two water bottles. You can hold two water bottles as you're doing it. Works out your muscles a little bit more. All right, here we go. And think heads or tails. Are you ready? Yeah, we're ready. Well, thank you for letting me know. It is heads, it's on the green side, so if you said heads, it's worth five. If you said tails, it's worth 10, but if you want to do 10, join us. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. All right, guys, awesome job. So now we need to stretch our muscles to get them to relax, right? Because maybe you're going to class after this or you already had class, but you're going to lunch now and you want to relax. Our muscles are a little bit tight right now because we were working hard. We were contracting them and we were making them a little bit tight. So we need to relax them now, all right? So first thing we're gonna do, and we usually wind up doing this one first, is shoulder stretch. So put one arm out, put it across, give it a hug, push that elbow back. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Shake it out and switch, other arm out, put it across, give it a hug. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20. Shake it out. Let's do the back scratchers. So scratch your back, push your elbow back, stretch in the tricep muscle, which is that exercise we were doing here. So we need to stretch that muscle and get it to relax. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Shake it out. Switch to the other arm, scratch your back, push your elbow back, stretches the tricep muscle right here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. All right, we worked our back muscles a little bit, so let's stretch out our back muscles a little bit. We'll twist up a little bit. So if you're sitting in a chair, I'll show you what it looks like. So if you're sitting in a chair here, Sit on the edge and just turn and grab the back of the chair and we'll hold it right there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. And we'll switch to the other side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. All right, let's bring it back to the front here and let's do side neck stretch. Here to your shoulder, pull to the side, stretches right here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, and switch to the other side. Stretch right in here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. All right, last one. Chin to your chest and pull down, stretch in the back of your neck. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 
15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20. All right, guys, great job today. Uh, I was talking with a third grade class yesterday, and I said to them at the end of the class, I said, what are some other things we can use to play this game, right? If you didn't have a coin, what other things could we use? Some said, well, I could cut a piece of paper and then use that to try to flip it back and forth, maybe throw it in the air and see where it lands so it could either be your heads or tails, they could color it different sides. Someone said, oh, I can get a piece of cardboard uh, or like a cardboard box, cut it in a circle because that's a little bit heavier so I could flip it and color again, heads or tails, and then I could play the game that way. So you can come up with different things. I suggested you get a stuffed animal, right? And you could flip the stuffed animal. If he lands on his stomach, it's one thing. If he lands on his back, and that could be your heads or tails, whatever you want to make it. So you could play this game at home. You just got to be a little creative. If you don't have a coin, that's okay. You can figure out something else to use. All right, guys. So again, awesome job. Great job. Hope you enjoyed it. And as always, enjoy. Boop, boop. Stay safe. Boop, boop. And stay hey, hey, active.